Delivering quality education. Expanding access to learning. The official TV-based instruction of Tagum City. This is Tagum City Division's Deaf and TV banner. Good day, dear learners. Welcome to another lesson full of knowledge, skills, and experience. I am your teacher, Rachel Sabinorio from La Filipina National High School. Join me as we start another fun and exciting lesson in TLE9. Make sure that you are comfortably seated and be ready with your paper and pen for note-taking. Welcome to another lesson in TLE9. Let's read first the objectives. At the end of the lesson, you are expected to First, enumerate the ingredients of salad dressing. Second, identify the types of salad dressing. And third, write down the important factors to consider in salad preparation. Which lead us to our most essential learning competency, presenting a variety of salads and dressings. Before we start, let me ask you, have you tried eating a salad? How does it taste? Can you identify the ingredients that compose your favorite salad dish? If so, kindly name its main ingredients. To assess your knowledge in this topic, let us try to answer the following questions to check how much do you know about presenting a variety of salads and dressings. Write your answers on a piece of paper. Are you ready, students? Let's start! You will identify the correct answer to the following questions. Number 1. Keep foods properly chilled and ice cold. True or false? The correct answer is false. Number 2. Fresh lemon juice may be in place to vinegar in some salad preparation. True or false? The correct answer is true. Number 3. Food and ingredients when overcooked eliminates the color and its vitamins and minerals as well. True or false? The correct answer is true. Number 4. Oil and vinegar salad dressings are generally thick and creamy. True or false? The correct answer is false. Number 5. Salad dressings are liquid or semi-liquids used to flavor salads. True or false? The correct answer is true. Did you get the perfect score? If yes, thumbs up! You have successfully answered our pretest. Let's have a short trivia. Did you know that salad taste refers to a time of youthful inexperience? A term coined by Shakespeare, whose Cleopatra characterizes her long romance with Julius Caesar as one occurring in my salad taste. 
when I was green in judgment, cold in blood. But before we proceed to our discussion, let us first define the following terms. Salad. It is a dish consisting of mixed pieces of food, sometimes with at least one raw ingredient. Salad dressing. A sauce for salads, typically one consisting of oil and vinegar mixed together with herbs or other flavorings. Emulsion. The uniform mixture of two mixable liquids such as oil and vinegar. Tartness. A sharp, sour taste. Let us proceed to our discussion. Salad dressings are liquid or semi-liquids used to flavor salads. The flavors of most salad dressings are not modified by cooking. The quality depends directly on the quality of the ingredients used. Most salad dressings are made primarily on oil and an acid with other ingredients added to modify the flavor or texture. Here are some examples of ingredients used in salad dressings. Oils. It should have mild and sweet flavor. Strongly flavored oil can make excellent salad dressing, but not appropriate with every food. Examples are corn oil, soybean oil, canola oil, peanut oil, olive oil, and walnut oil. Second, vinegar. It should have a good, clean, sharp flavor. Lemon juice. Fresh lemon juice may be in place to vinegar in some salad preparation. Egg yolk. An essential ingredient in mayonnaise and other emulsifier dressings. For safety, pasteurized eggs should be used. Seasonings and flavorings. Fresh herbs are preferable to dried herbs. Other flavorings include mustard, ketchup, Worcestershire sauce, and various kinds of cheeses. In a simple idea, a dressing is simply the sauces for salads. In Western culture, there are three basic types of salad dressings. First is the vinaigrette, usually a mixture or emulsion of salad oil and vinegar, often flavored with herbs, spices, salt and pepper, sugar, and other ingredients. Second is the creamy dressings, usually mayonnaise-based, which may also contain yogurt, sour cream, buttercream, or milk. And the third is the cooked dressings, which resemble creamy dressings or usually thickened by adding egg yolks and gently heating. When considering the type of dressing for the salad, use the flavor that complements and combines the flavors of the salad ingredients. If the greens or ingredients have strong flavors, use dressings that are robust in flavor. Delicate greens require a lighter weight dressing, so it does not overpower the salad ingredients. The weight of the dressing should also be considered, realizing lighter weight vinaigrettes will evenly coat salad ingredients, while creamier and heavier dressings provide a deeper and heavier coating. Did you understand? Good job! Now let's proceed to the important factors to consider in salad preparation. The following are important factors to consider in salad preparation. First, salad is as good as the quality of its ingredients. So you have to use ingredients that are fresh, ripe, and in season. Second, it should be attractive, appetizing, and creatively presented. Third, 
Make it simple and not overcrowded. Fourth, keep salad neatly placed in a salad plate. Fifth, contrast in color for your garnishing can accentuate the appearance of the salad. Sixth, choose combination of ingredients carefully. For example, Pineapples and coconut do not go well with chicken, but not compatible with tuna. 7. The taste of the food that you are using as a base should be identifiable. When you taste the salad and the dressing, should dominate the taste. 8. Keep foods properly chilled, but not ice cold. 9. Serve foods while hot and cold foods Cold. 10. To keep the vegetable clean and crispy, you have to wash them in large quantity of water and drain well. 11. Make the salad tempting and stimulating. 12. Drain the ingredients well. Water or excess juices will weaken dressings and will make your salad look messy. And the last factor, do not overcook food because it will eliminate the color as well as its vitamins and minerals. To sum it up, salad can be delicious, nutritious, and best enjoyed if the following factors can be followed appropriately. Did you get the idea? Great! Very good students! Now you know the important factors to consider in salad preparation. At this moment, we will answer the following questions to master what we have learned today. Are you ready? Number 1. What are the 5 ingredients of salad dressing? The correct answer are oil, vinegar, lemon juice, egg yolk, seasonings and flavorings. Number 2. Which type of salad dressing is a combination of oil and vinegar, often flavored with herbs? The correct answer is vinaigrette. Number 3. Give at least 3 important factors to consider in salad preparation. The correct answer are Eye appeal Simplicity Contrast Harmony and color Now, let us evaluate what you have learned. Direction Choose the correct answer among the given choices. Number 1 Which of the following is not a factor to consider in salad preparation? Letter A Contrast and harmony of colors Letter B Quality of ingredients Letter C, Arrangement of Food Letter D, Proper Food Combinations The correct answer is Letter C, Arrangement of Food Second question Mayonnaise is an example of Letter A Oil and vinegar emulsion Letter B Creamy dressings Letter C Cooked dressings Letter D None of the above The correct answer is Letter B Creamy dressings Third question 
salad is as good as the quality of its ingredients. So you have to use ingredients that are fresh, ripe, and blank. Letter A, in season. Letter B, cheap. Letter C, high quality. Letter D, in demand. The correct answer is letter A, in season. Take note that the ingredients of salad dressing are oil, vinegar, lemon juice, egg yolk, seasonings, and flavorings. This will enhance and make the salad tasty and appetizing. In addition to the ingredients of salad are the types of dressing, namely vinaigrette, creamy dressing, and cooked dressing. Always remember that the most important thing is that salad dressings should have well-balanced flavor with a pleasant tartness and should harmonize and complement the salad which they are served. I hope that you have learned a lot in our session today. In our next episode, we will discuss another fun and exciting lesson. I am teacher Rachel Sabinorio, leaving you this wonderful quote. A salad a day keeps disease and aging at bay. See you again next time only here at Salida La Filipina TV. Good day! Salida la Filipina ay bigyan daan Ito ay magbibigay na kaalaman TV naman ngayon ang inyong paaralan Makirap man ang inyong sitwasyon Tayo ay magtulungan para sa edukasyon Bawat isa ay mayroong misyon Matutong mabuti maging inspirasyon Salida la Filipina Ang iyong pangarap ay kikislam Salida la Filipina